You know, guys, I like to say to people that Hayabani Halbatoho Bangwa for witchcraft. And if you don't want to be given the reputation of Molotzana, don't do witchcraft. But unfortunately, witchcraft is this thing that produces ill-gotten gain. It makes people get things that they frankly don't deserve, that they never fathomed they could get overnight. And due to the fact that man is just deceitful above all things and desperately wicked mobilung, they are happy to run with things that they have not earned, to inherit inheritances and estates that are not theirs because they killed the true heir. Ba ratan jefela utzamaya, frolicking up here, up and down, momostrating, kan because they thoroughly don't believe in any eternal God who hates unjust skills and who is going to basically basically straighten everything that is crooked on earth. So Labantu Lava Bakti Nava Sanya Basan Sakita Baura Bauzwa and Bauzwa successfully. And it Luhu Chanta Kona Agwanagal. Bauzwa ba Sadi Baba Nya Disaganka and Bauzwa ba na from the womb staba sadi that found themselves barren and they have to adopt. Bauzwa become Mosodi career utole motu is it ill see you overnight that's not the qualification ni Bauzwa freedom. Yaba to go go danya ni utole motu twenty I spend twenty years in jail but somebody else takes the time for him and basically is replaced in in his position ba utwa miriri musadi like that is the crown of glory on her head next thing she's got alopecia ba utwa matalo a chiki got clear perfect skin next thing she's like breaking out into acne constantly and she ends up uh, what is this prematurely aging because of tampering with the face ba utwa guys like how nantoba sa utwin ba utwa bulenda wa motu next thing you find yourself excessively um, overweight when you were historically quite the fast metabolism girl ba utwa plans futures ideals because they cause you to downplay or second guess the the thing that you have conceived in your mind to achieve and so for those reasons what can I all down lead tools and if at all you down tools on your dreams because they've prospered to steal that particular inheritance and by get about who me or by get uh respected in society basena any real honorable thing about themselves and so because of all of this ill-gotten gain because of all of these things that they acquire basadi sebeleza heba tong ha seke ho bona ho re bakaza mamang neng ha seke ho sheba if next door neighbor ra ena le inge a kai hutswang ha se ke ho sheba e fngwana o montsha wa next door neighbor o o tshwere di mai a jwang mo mpenya gagwe before the poor girl can even ovulate and get her first period since then let's see ya se se ba ba ka o mutswela mpa ba u ba tshong they then go and check the male man ka montle o dropang off like di 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 um the males ba ba tla go bona hore o haona something ya this guy en ka monkela nyona ke re le domestic worker e se betsang kontlo nya bona ba tla mo checka spiritually ka di khala ba tsa bona ntse ba dietsang hore ke nye e this domestic worker they they amass for themselves covering and they amass for themselves much in this world by it's like embezzling funds you know how an embezzler will literally target a bank as if it's an administrator go banking and steal two cents or five cents or five rent from every bank account that they run some kind of a billing cycle through five rent of which the client is not going to notice and so they're not going to go and report it to the bank and getting five rent that's a one hundred thousand dranung redilaga bo kaimo is a 250 grand you are not 200 is a 250 grand i think it is now i stand corrected here it is that this person has amassed for themselves great wealth by stealing tiny little amounts from every person it's what they do they they go around society investigating as with a magnifying glass or however small however big because at the end of the day it amasses too much so because toyota test say 20 from 20 different people it's what you need to understand that's how they gather for themselves wealth it's how they am- that's why the world's population population is majority predominantly poverty stricken while there is a top 1% 1% they have literally stolen individually and incrementally the wealth of literally the global citizenship the wealthier they become these rituals yajonta from individual people on the ground until they have amassed for themselves great wealth the devil when he was tempting Christ in the wilderness said uh, worship me and I will give you the kingdoms of this world he knows it is possible to do that because he steals tiny little things a tile in one house and a tile in the other house a tile from 20 different houses a tile from 200 different houses in the neighborhood so they can tile their giant living room marawena all you're missing is one tile so you feel as if you imagine you have gotten nothing stolen from you but you have had a tile taken from you one tile is one tile too many what Christians are then to these witches is like the pedantic account holder or checking 
salary I can at the end of the month. I remember my mom telling me a story. She is an HR, um, telling me a story about some king employee. Oba musho di sitenga ten randa ko salary ni akh. Mutha tenge o ena tens of thousands of rands a month. I notice a ten randa esho tang. Every so often you get that person willing to make me when taking to a point miser. Ele ya high sali. It don't notice ang five randa esho tang. Ba bank wa joalo. They imagine everybody does not care for outliers, fluffy little things on the side. They imagine one kumundo is just happy in jefela udasta of a sprinkle of dust without doing a whole vacuuming job until they meet miserly souls miserly that literally latch onto every last rand and cent that they worked for to a point where they will raise a grievance with HR over 10 randa that is missing at the end of the month Christians are like those miserly people whose bank accounts whose bank accounts they can notice and pick up that there is literally five bucks missing from my overall pension payout and so this is not supposed to be happening not only that the law sometimes gives them prophetic gift to realize notice so these people sorry Christians because they not only notice 10 randa missing from their own bank account because you're Christian usually 10,000 from salary at 30,000 when it comes to Christians they target us in a very bizarre way but tactless so but until I'm sorry 10 grand out of salary at 30,000 of course it's on notice God what what they do because our standing in the gap for everybody is so prolific we not only like recalibrate or you know uh, reimburse 10,000 rands back to ourselves the other 100,000 people but I it's wing 10 randa or about I it's wing 2 randa ever say notice that is why I keep on telling people stop telling me to stop talking about witchcraft because you don't know how much money is missing from your bank account and over how many years you don't know already 2 rand 50 say mulloi wako next to answer dinka from wena how at the end of your life they have exponentially grown into what what that seed investment might have meant for you in the long run think about miscarriages for instance that they go and cause in women who lords I am Madi Abanabao to gain whatever motu give motu on the destiny of fella of filleting a human being has got a purpose and a destiny of fella of filleting ha pila up to the age of 90 whatever I achieved certain things on this earth and essentially shifted the paradigm of that nation in a certain way apart from that human being ever having never been born certain things would just very simply never have happened because of that person being around much in this world was shaken just one human being is incredibly um uh, influential in any ecosystem at all so when then you take a child gum miscarriage you are taking away that legacy that kid could have been a president that kid could have been the ceo of some giant organization that kid could have been a bit of an aaron brockovich to free a whole bunch of people from oppression thanks to some oil spilling company taking away the health of the residents living in that local community that kid could have been the one judge that uh, in the country changes uh, entire legislation to enable the poverty stricken uh, here down on the street to get their day in court to recalibrate this could have been a person that would launch a class action lawsuit that would reimburse people by nanangli lawsuit ya yeah, yeah, since the 80s that was left a cold case from the ground I, I revitalize it and actually give justice to Bana by the original plaintiffs let alone because the original plaintiffs said about or they are too old, old so the inheritance of that lawsuit payout ends up going to Bana Bateng could have caused that kind of a revolution and so ha that is how much in the long run 2 rand 50 eo meant it is a 2 rand 50 that could have grown into 10 million but you don't see it so because every every single time you try for a baby a president in your stomach a child also wins are so proud out of your stomach even the third and fourth child that you finally successfully conceived bring to term would have been is, is literally uh, they pale in comparison to what that first egg or that second egg would have done for you that is what they steal it's how they amass for themselves such great wealth these things start in the womb the devil understands what is the value of one individual human soul even in the state of an embryo do you understand so I can't keep quiet about it because Labantu Batonja are my entire destinies they are stealing presidents of countries they are stealing outcomes they are stealing lawsuits by a John in a mansion and you say 
I sebenzanga lenja itontile ba uzwa. It is why we need to keep on talking about this so as to wudidisa as Christians that we cannot be stolen from because there's no ending what they do. Bazo nda batu nda bantu batu batu la pele mara naike zama utu sabato. Or by protected by tsirilete by being serious kamudimu because we are done. It's easily stealable. It's very easy to, to rob a person when they are compromised in sin and when they are compromised in their relationship with God. The prayers of the wicked are an abomination to Emmanuel and sin hinders prayer. I am trying to foster great piety in the human race down below precisely for the reason of getting these thieves to not be able to steal. Mount.